It's now one month before Windows 10 support ends. And I found a way to make your unsupported PC last longer after support ends. For very cheap. If you haven't known, Microsoft announced that on October 14th, 2025, Windows 10 will have its end of life. This means there will be no technical support, new features, and security updates. This means you will be more vulnerable to viruses since there is no security updates. The only option to get more security updates is to upgrade to Windows 11. But many of us can't do that because most CPUs lack. TPM 2.0 like, why would they block most PCs from upgrading just because of a useless TPM requirement? They say it's for security, but why would they want an operating system with a useless security requirement? So many people are left stranded on Windows 10 with no way to upgrade since their PCs are unsupported. Microsoft says to buy a new PC, but... These PC prices are inflated with so much money. If you even get a cheap Windows 11 PC, it's so trash that it can't even run Roblox at 30 FPS. Microsoft also has an extended security update program, but it's... So expensive. Even a third-party patcher to patch vulnerabilities is also expensive. Plus, Windows 10 end of support increases the e-waste in landfills, which causes environmental risks and serious health problems. But I found a way to make your unsupported PCs last longer even after support ends. But you guys have to like and subscribe to reveal the answer. Okay, so you need a USB drive for this. Try to find one laying around. Then go to the first link of the description and download the ISO image. Now download and install Rufus, which is the second link in the description. Now insert your USB drive and insert the ISO to Rufus. And set the partition to GPT and then flash. This will wipe out any data stored on the USB, so make sure to back up your data. Now restart your PC and then press the key that enters into the boot menu. Now choose your USB drive to boot up, and it will bring you into the setup. Choose your language and hard drive on where you want to install, and then it will be installed for you. Now follow the instructions and after that you're done. Tiny 11 is a custom Windows ISO in which it reduces bloatware and improves performance. For gamers, you can try Optimum 11. Or if you want, you can try a Linux distribution which has better performance and no bloatware which has operating systems like Linux Mint, Zorin OS, Ubuntu, Arch Linux, Fedora, Nobara, Bazite, Steam OS, and many more. If you follow the instructions that I told you, you can revive your old PC and keep using it for decades to come. And it's for very cheap. So like and subscribe if this helped you.